Hey and welcome to Not Only Hollywood. Today I'm going through with The Dude and Me from 2019. This is a South Korean comedy. A gangster and a teenage boy switch bodies after an accident. The gangster takes over the body of the teenage boy who's in a coma. The gangster has to attend school and a new adventure begins for the former gangster trapped in a teenage body. The Dude and Me isn't a movie that invents anything new with the story it tells. If you have seen movies where people switch bodies and school movies from South Korea, then you know what's waiting for you. And what's waiting is bullying, falling in love, gangsters, fighting and family reconciliation. The gangster gets a surprise when he meets a girl who attends the same class and she's a bully victim. The teenage boy is also a bully victim, but that will soon end. The gangster who's in the body of the slightly overweight loser becomes a feared student at school. And he transforms the entire body of the loser boy who's in a coma into a slim fighting machine. He becomes the most feared and respected student among the boys at school and the girls fall for him. There's nothing new to find here. The movie can remind me of a known and popular movie series from South Korea, My Boss, My Hero, My Boss, My Student and The Mafia, The Salesman. So if you have seen the three movies in that series, you know what to expect if you watch The Dude in Me. The Dude in Me isn't an awful movie, but it's not a movie for people who have seen the best school movies from South Korea. The movie doesn't offer any surprises. The plot moves from A to B and there's not many surprises to find here. For me it's always disappointing when I know how this will end and what will happen before it happens. From 1 to 10 I give the dude in me a 5 out of 10. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Sleep well and dream about me.